So now this is just going to be a uh, quick video. Last uh, video, I grabbed this Zener diode out of this uh, baggie marked uh, 22 uh, volts. And I was pretty confident it was actually a 22 volt uh, Zener diode, but uh, we couldn't get our circuit up to uh, 22 volts, which uh, sometimes might be the fault of the Zener diode because it limits uh, uh, voltage. So if you have the wrong value Zener diode, you'll get the uh, wrong voltage. So there you can see uh, C22. So we know it is a 22 volt Zener diode. Now, many Zener diodes aren't a uh, full uh, voltage. You know, there's might be like a 2.2 volt Zener diode. How do we know that uh, that wasn't 2.2 and we just couldn't uh, see the decimal? Very good. So here you can see C uh, and then 5, now V1. So this is a 5.1 volt Zener diode. Instead of a decimal point, which you probably won't even be able to see on this component, they just take the V for voltage, the symbol for voltage, and uh, they put it where the decimal point uh, goes. So that's uh, a pretty common technique to use when you might not be able to see the decimal point. They just take the symbol and put it where the decimal point is. So that's all there is to reading uh, the Zener diodes. If you want to, um, make sure you check out one of the other videos that I'm posting on the screen and check out the links down below. They all help out a lot. I'll see you in the next video.